Hello and welcome to Bell Ringer News. I'm London Brazil and today is March 28th. Congratulations to the sophomore cooks that won yesterday's Chopped competition. Special thanks to Senora Galvez, Ms. Carta, and Mr. Demick for judging. Team rosters and payments for tomorrow's dodgeball tournament should be turned in today and tomorrow during all three lunch waves. Just a reminder that Monday, April 2nd, is a late arrival day for all students. School begins at 9.35. Any student interested in attending the Youth Forum meeting in Farmington on April 24th can see Mr. Archibald this week for a permission slip. Pay-to-play checks are due tomorrow. Checks are payable to East Hampton Board of Education. Be aware that the family cap is $500. Please bring in your checks to Mrs. Saunders in the main office. We the guidance department has decided to give students one more day to complete their course selection in power school by the end of the day tomorrow. If any students are struggling with any issues, please screenshot and email them to Mrs. Sullivan. Juniors, your second DC payment of $250 will be collected next Monday, April 2nd through the 4th. And now, here is Julian Minnick for the weather. Hello, I'm Julian Mick for Blowing Your Weather. So, for temperatures today, we're going to see a low of 39, high of 52, looking moderate temperatures, some showers in the day. Also, we're seeing a 100% chance of exposing. So, here at Bellringer News, we're all about the truth, digging deeper and deeper until we find the core of truth and goodness. So, yesterday I did some investigative research and... I found the score sheets for Chopped. Now, if we take a look at this one, with some handwriting analysis, we know who this is. They started to give the freshmen a 2 for taste. They crossed it out and wrote a 0. We didn't do very well. If you look at the other freshman sheet, they gave us a 2 for originality and then just left the, left rest, left the rest blank. That's all for today. Back to you. Thank you for listening and have a lovely day.